used to come around and uh, in the streets of Savannah. So I paid it back for memory. They used to come around in Savannah early in the morning with their wares. Get your pair in your hand, because here comes Shorty. Is that what it says? Mm -hmm. Brother has that tag in the back that says what it is. Oh, no. Sketch oh, thing that I did when I was three or four years old or something. Please. What's that one in the bag? That one's in the bag. Mm -hmm. And that one was in the paper, and I just got the idea from it into the newspaper. People lived over on that island that harvested crabs and oysters. It was in a book, too, wasn't it? Yeah. Magazine or something. That was my friend Lucy. Lucy Coco? Lucy. Coco, and she grew up in Savannah like I did, and she married that the fellow. Merlin. Merlin Coco. I remember. Uh, and she has a daughter that um, married out there, too. She has maybe some children, too. But Lucy and I were real good friends coming from Savannah. She worked at the engineers like I did. She, um, like the commercial part of the school, and she really was good. She was an artist? No, no, no. She just um, she worked was in the office. She was a, an executive secretary. When did you do that? was just one she painted. I think when we went out to the ranch, we went over. South Dakota way to the Indian Reservation. If y'all go out in Wyoming, you can go to see Marie. Mm -hmm. She doesn't do much ranching. It's original. And she lives out there by herself. Yeah. And a white jacket. <laughs> when he came to work. Was it Robert? That's Robert, yeah. Mm -hmm. It might be his name. Mm -hmm. It was a home for women, uh, women. And I still stay. I used to volunteer there oh, in yeah. high school and also in girls' yeah. went to the Georgia Well, it's still there. They didn't tear it down. It's a free medical clinic now sponsored by the churches. Dad was the biggest one Buick made, and your mother learned to drive in it sitting on a cushion. It's called 74. Is that what year it was? Yep. That's the year before I was born. It was painted in Ruidoso, New Mexico, at a seminar that Edith went to, to participate in Southwestern art. Well, she seemed to get a great deal out of as far as painting different depths of snow and trees yeah. and greenery.